Hey everybody, uh, welcome to another episode of Let's Open Some Packs. Uh, today I'm doing uh, some random packs, and it's actually a new thing I'm going to start doing because I have a ton of random packs. I'm doing these three kittens, which is an old one. I believe this is designed by, it says the Illusionist Playing Card Company. Um, I want to say that, uh, I don't want to say it. Anyway, so, oh, traditionally cut, cool. So kittens, Ooh. Uh, bicycle. Oh, before I get started, like, subscribe, hit the bell for notifications, and I'll tell you why. I'm about to, and I haven't done it yet, <laughs> but I'm going to do it after I film this one. This is going to go into a new playlist. I'm going to have playlists, and there's going to be like epic openings, um, vintage, and then uh, various uh, decks, which would be like this one. Epic openings will be the really long videos that have like 10, 10 decks and stuff like that. Um, that way, the new people, if you're new, hello, welcome to the channel. Uh, for those of you that have been here, thanks for sticking around. Um, yeah, I sound like a performer, don't I? I'm not really a performer. <laughs> anyway, so uh, I wanted to do, because I want to do these, and I don't want to just do one video for each of Not that they don't deserve one video, uh, but I want the videos, I don't know, I kind of want to do something in the middle between very short and very long. Um, so something that's kind of like, you know, in the, in the middle anyways, and I'm gonna try it out. See what y'all think. If y'all like it, uh, like the video, uh, put a comment below, uh, and there'll be three kind of in the same theme. So these are going to be like, uh, these are kind of in the same where they're character based, uh, and kittens is one that I've been wanting to, I want to say, I thought I had opened this, uh, I, and, and I now remember now I went to somebody's house maybe and they had it and i was like oh that's cool so we'll start with kittens okay so that's what's going to happen hopefully i don't forget to do the playlist uh and if you go to the to my playlist you'll see like let's open some packs which will be every single video and then the other three that i mentioned uh that'll have them sorted for you so you don't have to you don't have to look or you can subscribe to those as well all right cool let's get started let's do Ooh, kittens is going to be good we'll do kittens last we'll, we'll go in this order this is an older one too uh, this one I just got. This one's really cool. So, and the reason it's really cool is because the design is what is what I think is going to be awesome uh, with these. Because um, it's this dude, the Minion. And I I kind of like these movies. Universal Studios. Cool. So it's official. Look at that. There's even a little... I didn't know they had that. That's neat. A little uh, QR thing. So, I'm drinking coffee, by the way. <laughs> when you drink iced coffee, by the way, if you have pro tip, and I say this in a lot of my videos, if you have hot coffee and it gets cold, just add ice to it. So it's like it's not in the middle, you know, and the middle sucks. And I, wait a second, take backs, because this video is going to be in the middle. <laughs> so this video is in the middle temperature wise, not time wise. Um, cool. All right. So let's let's do this. Let me open this. And I saw the design on these and I'm like, that's cool. And the reason I say that is because um, I was looking for some Mickey Mouse Disney ones. If y'all know of any good ones, put them in the comments, please, because I want to do a Mickey Mouse video. Um, I grew up with Mickey Mouse. Love Mickey Mouse. And um, one of the things that I liked about this is they, they took the, the design to a design level. So it's not just like, here's a character, copy-paste, you know? It's, they, they, they literally did, look at that little guy right there. You see him? See, like little little details like that is what I think is going to be on the deck, um, and yeah, that's what that's what really got to be interesting. Cool, that's so minion. I didn't know. Is that a thing in the movies? I was gonna I was gonna go watch the new one with my kids. That's cool. So the, I'm assuming these are the Jokers. Oh, we'll look at the back in a bit. Uh, let me put these over here. That's so minion. Um, oh, let's just look at the back now. Love it. It says Bello, which I believe is Bello. Is how you say it. I'm not sure if that's how you read it, but look at this the simple design. That's like the simple the I I believe that's the character's name too, Bayo. Bello, right? Am I right? Uh but look at that. Isn't that cool? Like it's just a simple design. And I love yellow. So this this really this deck really talked to me. And stuff like that, see? Um they they didn't just take a picture of the character and put it there, is what I mean. They actually made it. And then oh, and look at that. Isn't that cool? It's so simple and subtle. Uh, oh, and they're doing it on the three, too. I didn't know they were going to do it everywhere. Oh, wow. Okay, so they're doing different minions. Um, or the other one. The two-eye one and the single-eye one. Cool. In the set. So y'all are seeing this, right? Like, y'all can see it pretty... Yeah, I'm just checked. Oh, cool. They're doing both there for the ten. 
Oh, nice. So these are, this is art. So this is not a 3D. And that's what I mean. Um, maybe they drew this or maybe they got it from the concept team. I'm assuming they drew it themselves, whoever did this. Um, great design. I love this. Um, man, I love this. And I want to do a low run with my with my little dudes too. This is another reason I got it. Uh, by the way, when I when you see a lot of these decks, I'm I make my own stuff. And I haven't shown y'all too much of my more com uh, complex stuff, I should say. The deck I printed is a simple one, and I did that to understand the industry and how it, how you work with the printers. And uh, the next one's going to be more complicated, and I'll show y'all. I got to do a video on that. Um, I'm pretty close. I just have one more. No, I did both courts. Yeah, I have. They're sketched out. There's a lot of it is done. Anyways, I'm talking about mine, not, not this one. Let's talk about this deck. This isn't about me, yo. <laughs> I'm sitting here talking about me. So, you know, like my hair uh, and my things and I like stuff. And I'm, it's all about me. Anyways, so let's see. We have... Um, oh, look at that. That's your difference. So black and yellow. Black and yellow. I just did another deck that did black and yellow recently. Black and yellow, black and yellow. I like that rap song. Cool, so they're doing the same thing there. Oh, okay. Man, I love this little guy. He's like, he's so cute. Wait a second. This looks like my guy. <laughs> oh my goodness. I should post a picture of Diggo. I'm going to post a picture of Diggo right now. Right, let's find, uh, let me get a good one. Uh, maybe this one. What do y'all think? Let's put him there. What do y'all think? Kind of similar? Not really. My dudes are yellow too, though. That's why I say that. And I got to remember to put that in the video. <laughs> okay, cool. Look at that. Oh, man. The little eight is like my favorite one. The seven's cool too, though. I like the little eight, though. The three, too, looks pretty good. And the two. Oh, that's cool. So they're doing the... Uh, what is the ace over here doing? Oh, okay. So they're doing the same thing. So the... Okay. So then is this one going to be... Sorry, I'm going to skip ahead. We have these two cards we'll look at in a second. Okay. Interesting. They did the same the same ace there that they do here. Oh, no, the different hairstyle. Okay, that's what they're doing. See the little hairstyles? That's cool. Okay. Sorry, I'm like trying to figure out the deck, how they did the design. Um, okay. So then the... Sorry, I'm trying to... Interesting. So they're going back and forth between the one the one eyed guy and the two eyed guy with the hair. Okay. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> they look really similar. <laughs> I love this guy's hair. That's cool. Little like thing on top like that. Such a good design. Such a good design. And I'm not saying that because they uh that's the ace of hearts. Uh and the ace the ace ooh. And they feel good of course. Look at that. I don't know who printed these, y'all. These are manufactured by the United States Playing Card Company. Well, there you go, in Erlanger, Kentucky. That's why, they feel like thin crust right now. They feel like, it. I don't know if they are, but they're very soft, really good stock. Uh, what are they fan like? Nice, just yellow, just yellow. Uh, let's look at these two. You get two, but you could probably do some cool tricks with that. Uh, some reveals, or not, maybe you just wanna collect. Huh, did you see that? There's a little line there in the middle. That's cool. Love it. I'm digging this one. This is a much better deck than I expected. I only got one. Uh, I think I got it for 10 bucks too. Pretty cheap, pretty good. This one uh, is really cool. This is a, this is a um, Bros Mines. And every card has a piece of this art on it. <laughs> I love this art, look at that. Pretty cool, huh? I like this style. <laughs> the girl has a little thing that says girls. It just says girls. Oh my goodness. This is awesome. What is this dude? He's like a... All right, we'll get in there. I'm sorry. And I like... Look, this is the kind of deck that I like. Yes. It just says yes. <laughs> what? Oh my goodness. Have you ever seen uh, like the spray paint fails where people like write like stupid stuff and uh they're like trying to be all cool <laughs> and they like misspell words and stuff oh my goodness 
That was me, y'all. <laughs> That's why I think it's funny. Uh, I don't know much about Bro's Minds other than when I saw this. this I think it was even featured on Bicycle's website. Um, and I said, I like it. And then it sold out. And I was like, what? So I had to get them on Amazon. Um, of all places, right? <laughs> like you, you can't get them from Bicycle directly. Love it. All right. So, oh, and it's got a seal. Look at that. Oh, so this is going to be standard bike stock, I'm assuming. Uh, let's refuel. Uh, iced coffee, y'all. Pro tip: if y'all ever, if y'all ever like, if it ever happens, remember my voice. <laughs> All right, here we go. Okay, what do we got here? We got. Um, have you seen Bro's Mind? Uh, AKA Juan Alejandro have been kidnapped by the. Oh my goodness! So they're being kidnapped. No one has been willing to fork up that kind of money for the... Okay, I don't know what, what that's about. Maybe there's like a game. It's kind of long. Like when I see that, you don't want me to read all this. Uh, so you have to go to brosmind.com. And man, look at that art, yo. Cool, huh? Another reason I got this. So uh, this is the kind of like art that I do that I like, right? So it's a very... Uh, it's Man, that's such a cool back design. Has this been done before? Just a brick wall? If it has, let me know. Um, Cause yeah, it's so cool. It's so simple. So this is upside down. It looks like we're gonna start with the ace. Jokers, you got mirror jokers there uh, with the hand signals. So the hands are different, but the looks like the, everything else is, oh no, one's riding, one's walking. Wow, that's cool. Man, good art, yo. Good art, uh, four gangs. Uh, Bro's mind, people, love it. Check out this ace of spades. See, that's what I'm talking about, y'all. That's a custom ace. That looks tight. Do, do people still, still say tight? You can still say cool. That looks cool. Nice. Fresh. Okay, we've got a lot of art to go through. So, yeah, we're already at like 12 minutes or so. Um, 10 minutes. And this is one of those, like I said, this is one of those videos where I'm going to go to like three decks and... Uh, just look at some art. <laughs> the world that is so wacky. Isn't that interesting? Like each one has a piece of art on it. Each one. Um, yeah, this is one of those decks where I was like totally impressed by how much art they did. Um, and it's just cool art, you know? Really cool art. Look at that. What is that dude doing? He's got a snake on his head. He's a king. Peligro. TNT. That means danger. And there's that yes tattoo right there on his hand. Yes. <laughs> what? That's an awesome ace. Dude, look at that. These aces are the best. Love it. Very inspirational, by the way. Again, this is very similar to the way I do stuff. Uh, not the the wacky style, like uh, the, the you know the line art, this kind of thing. Uh, they're going beyond what I'm doing, like with with regards to the the wacky creativity. You know, um, this guy's interesting. A little diamond in his head. Um, this guy, this guy has a caliber. <laughs> He's measuring card thickness um, to find out. You know, you could you could take a caliper and be like, how thick is this card? Uh, just to see so you can like take notes there's there's some people there's reviewers that do that um the caliper uh i believe magic orthodoxy does it he measures card thicknesses with calipers um i have a caliper i i don't use it though i should i should use it to measure something what that guy is creepy dude he has three faces i don't know if you can tell those aren't ears uh, that's the queen. Okay, makes sense. The jack is all buff. Dude, that's cool. That's cool. This is my favorite one. And it's the jack of clubs. Y'all know the jack of clubs is my favorite. Or maybe y'all don't. If you're new here, like, subscribe, hit the bell for notifications. Yeah, I really, 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 really like the jack of clubs. I like everything about that card. And I can explain one day why. One day there will be an explanation. This is a cool card too, the six clubs. Man, that's such a wacky design. It's so cool. I love this stuff. Sorry, I didn't think the video would be this long. Uh, thanks for for those of you that are sticking around. Ace of Clubs looks cool too. 
Uh, not my favorite one so far. I like the Ace of Diamonds and the Ace of Spades so far. Let's see what the Hearts does. Um, okay, so we're doing the same thing here. Ace. Okay, so the, he's, they are following like um, they are following a pattern, if you can tell. Uh, I'm assuming this is all. This is not digital art. I mean, maybe I don't know. I'm gonna say that they drew this and then they took it into a computer and then they mess with it there. They hand drew it. Oh, that guy's cool. It's very Cabbage Patch. I don't know if you all know what those that is, but reminds that's the first thing I thought of. We're about to get to the Ace of Hearts and cool. So the Ace of Diamonds and the Ace of Spades were my favorites. Oh, cool. Man, y'all should do another back design then. They only did this one. Um, do this one now. This is cool, right? <laughs> I love it. Oh, hold on, let me put this away. Um, great art. I did not, I like I said, I, I had only seen a few of the cards and I was sold. The cover sold me to the box, the tuck box. These are, these are, yeah, these are modern cut. I believe these are modern cut, unless it says traditional. Um, doesn't say anywhere. Bicycle. No, it doesn't say, but it is USPCC. Um, feel good. Feel like USPCC. They feel like they kind of feel just like standard bikes. Don't think they're thin crushed. Uh, these, this deck feels better. If you're wondering, uh, this deck looks cooler. <laughs> yeah, see how fast that is. That's how I do it. I know there's gonna be people like, oh, you can't tell, dude. Okay. Maybe we could do a test. You know, there was a thing. Uh, let's see how they fan. There was this thing that I used to tell people. Oh, dear. Um, there was this thing I used to tell people. Um, I can tell when someone has their phone on air, not airplane, yeah, airplane mode, or if they're doing, um, uh, you know how you could do a hotspot on your phone? I can put my hand over a phone and I can feel it. And people are like, yeah, right. I'm telling you, like I had a Game Boy, a, 3D, a 3DS. Same thing. I could like I would turn the Wi-Fi on that thing. Oh my goodness, I could feel it. I'm sensitive, y'all. <laughs> All right, kittens. I got this from the Illusionist. Um, I think it's Illusionist.com. It's right there. See? Whoa, that was cool. I just like came into focus. Pretty cool, huh? Uh, yeah. So it says. Madison. Oh, right. That's what. See, that's a, so that what I wanted to say earlier. Madison designed these. Um, the magician and Daniel Madison. Uh, traditionally cut playing cards made in the USA. Now I saw this and I'm like, man, if I ever made a movie, and I was doing like a, a scene where there was a bunch of tough, a tough people like playing cards, this is the deck I would use because <laughs> it's so funny. Like they're all like, it's all serious. And then you have, ta-da, <laughs> little kittens. And the back is, oh, there's a reveal. Okay, so this is made for magic. Um, and nine of clubs. Uh, and I believe this is, are we getting duplicate aces? Yeah, we're getting duplicate aces. Oh, okay, that's cool. That's cool. So this is made for magic, as you can tell. Um, and then you get the ace of spade with the, the crow. I know that dude likes crows. And then what's this one? Another nine of spades. Cool. So I believe the nine of spades can be used. No. Okay. Cool. So you get a lot, a lot to work with there, with regards to uh, no jokers. Yep. So this is a magic deck, straight up. Ooh, and it feels very thin. I don't know who printed this. So you get mat. So this is a magic deck. You're gonna do magic with this, um, or you could play. I'm sure you can play card games with the two, but there's no jokers. Was it the United States Playing Card Company? It doesn't say. I don't know, y'all. I don't know who printed this. I feel good. Uh, I had a deck pr uh, from The Illusionist. They got the click really, really quick. You know what the deck click is? That's <laughs> so funny. Can you imagine the tough guys playing with these cards? And it's like, what do you got? And the guy's like, three kings. And it's like, four aces. Anyways, um, and then the kitties show up. Um... I, I got the deck click on one of their decks. And if you live in a dry environment, you probably know what I'm talking about. And you play with cards a lot. The deck click. Man, we're already at 20 minutes. They feel really good. Sorry, I was... <laughs> three decks. 
It's a podcast, yo. All right, so let's check it out. Let's go through these real quick or take our time. Um, they have this little pattern. I don't like those little patterns, y'all. You see it? it? They like make the cards look dirty or whatever. Uh, or used, like used paper. I like it when it's boom, it's just clean. Um, so it's standard. Looks like it's, yeah, it's standard. Um, oh, it, and I believe maybe that's him, the King of Spades. Does he have tats on his face? Maybe no. He always wears sunglasses. I've never seen him without sunglasses. So I don't even know what the dude looks like. Um, Ace of Spades. Did I show you all the cute little Ace of Spades there? Oh, he ate the bird. That's what the on the, what's on the other one. You could do like a reveal where the the cat eats the bird. Man, I love that stuff. That's cool. Where you could do magic. Um, cool. Okay, so it's standard quartz. I don't know who that is. I've seen that dude before. Nine of clubs on his hand. See it? Um, oh, that's cool. So you have the other nine of clubs. You could like hide it somewhere. And then, yeah, this is neat. I love when people do, so the illusionist is doing the whole, uh, um, uh, so some custom faces, it looks like. They're doing the whole magic trick deck. So you get a bunch of stuff. Oh, so it's only the ace of spades that has the kitten. Okay, so you could do the, um, with that, you could, where's the bird? This is going to be really loud, but you could do like, you could have the, the bird there. You can be like, hey, there's the bird. And you go, so you could totally see it too. So you, <laughs> you can do that. Like, you know, and you could, if, if I was in a different position, I promise you it wouldn't be so loud. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Or I'll just do like a simple color chain. Like there's the bird. And then you can go, oh, oh. Oh, and then there's the card. Okay, so that's the review. Uh, oh, wait, before I do, let me just do one quick. I already did this, right? No, I did not. Let me do the Phantom. Sorry. But this is the review. Uh, if you're still around, thanks for watching. God bless all of you. Uh, yeah, I'm going to put this in the various decks collection. I'm going to do three at a time, maybe four, uh, but usually three. Uh, and that's the video. Thanks for watching. God bless all of you, and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers! Cheers!